Hi there everybody, it's UK independent demonstrator Halsey here from slimandstylish.com and today I have this quite simple but I think very elegant invitation for you that says raise your glass to the new year with this martini glass on the front. This is using the Sip Sip Hooray photopolymer stamp set and the Cheers to That cling stamp set that can be found in the Stamping Up holiday catalogue. I love New Year. I think it's a great time of year. I don't go out, um, out, out partying, but we invite the neighbours round to ours or we go next door to our neighbour's house. But this year it's our turn and we invite everybody round to ours on New Year's Eve. We play board games and we have many cocktails and we also have a buffet um, and different things up until New Year. Where I live, I live on a massive great big hill. Um, we're some miles out of Birmingham, but from the top of our hill you can see into Birmingham city centre. So at about five to midnight we all go out and everybody from the street all comes out as well. And we watch the fireworks from the top of the hill and it's a really just, it's a nice evening. We come back in, we finish the games, we have a few more cocktails and that is our new year. So I wanted to make some invitations to invite people around and this was the invitation that I've chosen this year. I love this Cheers to That stamp set. It's not just a New Year's stamp set. It could be used for weddings because it does have bride and groom on it. It has Christmas on it, but I just think it's really nice fonts and really unusual. So I was quite chuffed to see that in the catalogue. I have a 9.5 centimetre by 13.8 centimetre piece of Whisper White cardstock and my Memento ink. I've already put all of my sentiments onto their blocks. So at the top, I'm just going to put in the center, raise your glass. This font is adorable. And I love that it's slightly curved as well. I just think it's so unusual. And then there's the to the new year sentiment for the bottom, which I'm just gonna place in the middle. There we go. I'm going to grab my martini glass from the Sip Sip Hooray stamp set. This is photopolymer, so it's great. It means that when I go and put the marti sorry the olives into my martini glass, I'll be able to see where I'm stamping. So I'm just going to pop that in the middle of the card, just there. And there's the olives. So I can make sure that they are in the glass. There. the lid on. Now I've used the blends to colour this one in so I'm going to use cherry cobbler and this is the light cherry cobbler and I'm just going to run around the edge of my olive and over where the stone is on both. Granny apple green, now these don't go and they won't look right together at all but I'm going to use petal pink over the top of both. So this is the light petal pink. And I'm using the bullet tip and I'm just going to colour over the top of both of them. It bleeds a bit of the colour out but it also merges them into each other. And it just makes a very subtle difference to the olives and I quite like that. So it makes it a bit like that. I quite like that in the cup. And then I'm using dark sea foam along the edges of my martini glass. And coming in with the light soft sea foam just to blend it all in together. cardstock. So this is a piece of A4 cardstock cut in half, scored in half and I've already folded and burnished it. And I have a piece of basic black. This runs the full length. So this is 14.8 centimetres down. So it falls, runs the full length of my card but it's only 10 centimetres across so it just has this edge on. I'm just going to grab my Tombow and stick this to my card base. 
This was so simple to make. You could cover it in Wink of Stella to give it that little bit of sparkle for New Year. I haven't. I quite like it as it is. I was going to. I got the Wink of Stella out, but sometimes I think if you're happy with how it looks, why change it? And I'm just going to drop the tumble on the back of this. And bring it up to the top so it leaves this darker border down the bottom, which I quite like. And there we go. My invitation cards ready to pop in the post for New Year. I hope you enjoyed. If you do like either of these sets, they're available to purchase from my online store. Just head to slimandstylish.com, go to the header and click buy, and you'll find them both in my shop. Don't forget to use the hostess code and you get an extra goodie for me at the end of the month. Thank you for joining me today. If you've liked the project, do subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye.